Hi friends, in this video let us see circuitry related question asked in gate 2016. The question is the switch has been in position 1 for long time and abruptly changes to position 2 at t is equal to 0. If time t is in second, the capacitor voltage Vc in volt for t greater than 0 is given by 4 into 1 minus e power minus t. It is not a minus plus, it is minus t. Minus t by 0 0.5 minus t by 0 0.5 10 minus 6 4 into 1 minus e power minus t by 0 0.6 10 minus 6 e power minus t by 0 0.6 right so this is the circuit they have given so let us see that we have to find what is the voltage across capacitor vc okay so first we see when t is less than 0 that is at t is equal to 0 minus Right, switch goes to on position only at t is equal to 0. So, when t is less than 0, the circuit the switch is in position 1, right? Okay, so the circuit looks like this plus minus 10 volt, 3 ohm. Okay, so next to uh, oh, 3 ohm uh, here, 2 ohm. Right, switch is in position 1. So it will be like this. Right, the capacitor is open for DC. So what is VC 0 minus 1 voltage across capacitor is voltage across 2 ohm resistor. So VC 0 minus is equal to I apply voltage divider rule 10 into 2 divided by 2 plus 3 that is 5 volt. Fine okay so vc0 is 5 volt we know that capacitor cannot change voltage instantaneously this implies vc0 minus is equal to vc0 plus that is equal to 5 volt sorry 10 by 5 4 volt sorry it is 4 volt okay this is 4 volt this is 4 volt Okay, switch is closed at t is equal to so when at t is equal to zero, switch moves to point two. So when t tends to infinity, that is under steady state, switch moves to position two. Position two here we have one four ohm, two ohm, four ohm, two ohm. Okay, here capacitor will be there. So what happens when switch is okay now? At t is equal to infinity, the circuit will be like this. Okay. Now here it is 4 ohm. Here it is 2 ohm. Right, switch move to position 2. Now, um, what happens? Uh, here it is 2 ohm. Right. So steady state current, so capacitor is opened, okay, fine. Now this is what the circuit will be. Now we know VCT is equal to V infinity plus V0 minus V infinity e power minus T by RC, right, okay. So what is V infinity right here? Voltage across capacitor V infinity. Fine. So here 5 ampere source is available. Right. So voltage across this element is same V infinity. So it is 5 ampere here. Right. It is open. So here current is 0, 5 ampere. So 2 into 5, 10 volt. So voltage across this side is 10 volt so v infinity is 10 volt here i0 open circuit right so all the current will flow through this okay now vct now i need rc value rc is nothing but r tavern in right r tavern i have to find under steady state i have to find r tavern in so we know under steady state at t is equal to infinity we have 4 ohm 2 ohm 2 ohm for that, I have to find the equivalent circuit. 4 ohm. Fine. Okay. Next, uh, 2 ohm. 
here to row. Fine. So now I have to find the R in this side. R in is given by R in. See, we know when you find R in, we have to remove the source. Here I have current source that I remove, so it will become open circuit. So this one I have to find R in because across the C only we have to find. So R in is this one. Here current is zero, so this will not take into consideration. So R in is these two resistors are coming into picture. So four plus two. 6 ohm. Now RC is R in 6, C is 0.1 farad. So it is 0.6 second. That is what time constant. So VT is equal to V infinity plus V0 minus V infinity e power minus T by RC. So what I get is V infinity is uh, 10 volt plus V04 minus 10 e power minus T by 0.6. So that is equal to 10 point okay. So 10 minus 6 e power minus T by Point six. That is what Vt. So, which option is correct? 10 minus 6 e power t by 0.6. And let us see 10 minus 6 e power minus t by 0.6. Option D is the right answer. Thank you.